right. Hey, seriously. The beauty of watching these young guys come up is you can kind of pick off the Ellie Dela Cruz's and some of the younger guys, Spencer Steer. It's all happening at the same right time for the Cincinnati Reds, and they are athletic and they are dynamic. And there's a lot to like about what they're doing. They get a healthy Lodolo coming back next year with a Hunter Green. Start mixing and matching, starting to imagine Graham Ashcraft, imagining a pitching staff that can go with these boys offensively. You might have a run in you this year, Cincinnati, especially with him playing shortstop. Matt McClain is doing some things, and to get drafted twice in the first round, there hasn't been many guys who have been able to do that. Wow. He was coming off a monster AAA start. Do we have the first board, J-Mac, what he was doing in AAA as opposed to now? Mr. McClain. Take a look at this, AAA. 348 with 12, a 474 on base, and a slug of 710. A weighted run. Yeah, it was time for him. He had mastered that level. So let's get him to the big leagues. And all he's done has been Mr. Reliable. 328 with three, but he's doing it in a variety of ways. He's got pop. He can lay a bunt down. He put it all on display last night. So let's get in. I want to go back to his high school days because this guy has been a prospect from jump. Out in California, 2017, he gets picked in the first round by the Diamondbacks. He turns it down to go to UCLA. And then he gets picked in the first round again by the Cincinnati Reds. So bet on himself twice to go to college. Wanted that experience, get a little bit better. So I always say, you're some version of your high school self. Run this real quick. Very simplistic move to the baseball. Very short, and here he is in college. Run this back. Take a look at it. Let's go through it. What are we trying to accomplish? Level head. It's funny, we'll get into the elbow up. That never felt comfortable to me. Some guys like it up here. Some guys are really loose and natural with their back elbow. For me, I always felt that that made me feel really stiff, but we'll get into like the Alex Bregman, Bregman some other guys who keep that back, back elbow up there, right? Level head, what do we talk about? Getting into your back knee, the inside of your back knee. Setting it down and rotate and go. Take your hands to the baseball. Bad head replaces the hand. So he's looked like this since his high school days. And then we bring in a little bit of Alex Bregman. Run it back for me real quick. Ooh, good time. I mean, that's who he reminds you of, the way he plays the game. Alex does some things a little bit differently. He doesn't think hands. He almost sets them. And he's trying to pull his hands across his chest. Kind of a very interesting way about thinking about hitting, trying to get the knob of the bat ahead of the baseball. Not something everyone thinks. Matt McClain a little bit more old school, but similar in their setup and skill set. Run this. Mm. And he's been hot. He's been on fire for this team. And it's awesome to see. I mean, there's so much young athletic star power in their lineup now that you can't help but want to put a Cincinnati Reds game on. I mean, they're young, they're in trust. Spencer Steer's playing well. The Ellie Dela Cruz guy, I can't come up with a comp. I've never seen a guy play baseball like that. And then Mr. McClain, just kind of doing it old school, got hot. Yesterday was on display. Bring up the board of the guys that were drafted twice. This is pretty cool. Wow. All right, notable position players drafted twice in the first, first round. Jason Veritek right there. J.D. Drew turns down to Philadelphia Phillies, gets drafted, goes this, I think he went the independent ball, and then surface with St. Louis the next year. Show him yesterday, because it's all the different things he's able to do and we'll get out. Okay, take a look at that. We're gonna play a little push bunt, play the game the right way. Boom, I didn't have that in my game. Matt McClain certainly does. He beats it out right there. Now Jonathan India, little fly ball to left field. Gets away. Most guys are standing on third. Nope, he reads it well. We're sending you. We're sending you. We're getting aggressive. He's cutting the bags the right way. Slides into home. We're going to impact John defense, second base. He's just doing a lot of things right to help this team win. He can play up the middle, and then he's got pop to go with it. Kaufman in the gap. See you later. So there, there's a lot of good young players in the game. 
He's certainly one of them. And the Cincinnati Reds are going to be an interesting watch for the next 100 games.